everybody and welcome back to my channel. This week's video is going to be a product review video. I've not done one of these videos in a little while so I thought why not. So the products I'm reviewing on is like a Kylie lip kit dupe. It's the Makeup Revolutions Retro Lux Matte Lip Kit and they're only £6 each. So it's a Retro Lux Matte Lip Kit. The lip contour kit contains one lip liner and one liquid lipstick. You get one gram in there. Yeah, the packaging's really, really cute. I think it looks really, really luxurious. And to be honest with you, I love the Kylie lip kits. I've got a little obsession with them now, started collecting them. Need to ignore the foundation lips. I've actually had a, a Kylie lip kit on today. I can't remember which one I had on. I had the dark purple one and it always stains my lips, so I've had to just try and cover it with some kind of foundation just to make it not so obvious and plus it's probably got a better layer for the lip kit too. Go on. So I've got the colours Regal and Glory. So I'll try Glory first before Regal because Regal looks quite dark. So I shall open him up. It's sealed at the top. The only thing is when you go to the Makeup Revolution counter you always found the count that you count to be filthy. People have pulled all stuff out of the packaging. It really winds me up. Just because it's drugstore makeup doesn't mean you can open it all up and throw it everywhere. I actually saw these on a Facebook post. I think someone had done like a YouTube post on it, swatching all the colours. I was like, oh my god, I need to have them. They also do like a gloss as well, and I want to try those. Oh, and they do a metallic as well. So when you open the lip kit, it's just like the Kylie ones. It's crazy. So inside, ooh quite nice packaging actually. This is what it looks like and this is what the lip liner looks like. I think it just looks really, really luxurious even though we know it's not with the Makeup Revolution. Just, I love the rose gold and also on the lip liner as well. It just looks really, really nice. So let's try it. So I need a little mirror of some sort. Right, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do the lip liner and then put the matte lipstick on top look if these are any good i'll probably just end up getting them all i've got a little a little obsession with lip kits kylie one and i love the matte look because it just lasts all day so i'm just going to pop this on my lips oh it's very oh it goes on very nice very creamy I'll tell you what i think i might zoom in while i'm doing this zoomed in very very closely so, I'm hardly pressing on it all. I don't think I'm going to fill all my lips in, to be honest. So I'm just going to pop the matte lipstick on top now. That's very nice. Ooh, I do like this. It's just a normal doe foot applicator. I really have the smell. Oh, it's a lot darker than the lip liner. Mmm, it's a little streaky. First thoughts, it's a little streaky, but it's nothing I couldn't. Oh. It's a little streaky, but it's nothing I couldn't work with. I did have to layer it up a few times. It didn't have no smell to it, which is great because some of them smell horrible. Yeah, it's alright, it doesn't feel drying. My lips have kind of got that little bit of tackiness. I don't know how long that's going to last for. I do, I do really, really like it. It's really nice. So I'm gonna let it dry, and then I'll, uh, I'll see what it's like when it's dry. I'll come back. Okay, I'm back. I feel like it's dried now, but I feel like it's still a little bit tacky. Like, 
I sort of like that. I mean, to be fair, for a six pound matte lipstick, you can't really complain, can you? So, I'm going to now try the colour Glory. So this is the colour Glory. Looks like quite a nice brownie colour, and that's the lip liner. And like last time, I'm going to pop the lip liner on and then pop the matte liquid lipstick over the top. So that's what this colour looks like. I actually think I like this one better. It just went on a bit easier. Um, it was a little bit streaky again. It is a little bit tacky. But to be honest with you, for £6, I can live with it. So all in all, I really did enjoy these liquid lipsticks. Um, I might actually get some more colours because you find sometimes different colours tend to, be, tend to have different formulas and they go on a lot different so yeah that was just a little a quick little review video i hope you enjoyed this video i would love it if you subscribe to my channel check out my facebook and instagram accounts or blah 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 everything is linked in the description box below and i'll see you in my next video bye